The Russia case. Each day it seems more and more like a mob investigation. We have a consigliere, we have recorded phone calls, we have money changing hands, we have a discussion, cash or check. So this is Talk of Mobsters. How nervous should President Trump be about Michael Cohen's cooperation with the special prosecutor? Very nervous. When the offices, hotel, and home of Michael Cohen were raided, the White House freaked out. And now we know why. Michael Cohen is not the most trustworthy man in the political universe. However, this happens in cases all the time. Prosecutors use witnesses who are not terribly credible, who are not terribly reliable, who have sleazy backgrounds. That's why they're there to witness crimes and to participate in crimes. The latest allegation from Michael Cohen is a killer. He's alleging that the president, in advance of that infamous June 9 meeting in Trump Tower, that Donald Trump was told about the meeting and approved it. This is collusion. The best prosecutor to deal with a mob trial and a mob investigation, of course, is Robert Mueller. So he's the right man on the case. And that's what this case is boiling down to, flipping low-level people to turn on their superiors and following the money. It's a mob case.